Welcome to the Apothecary. This Apothecary was built in 1854 by Dr. Ben Davis. He practiced his medicine and making medicine for about 50 years. He died in 1902, but he was married with three children and he had one of his sons, George, that followed in his footsteps. But come on in and enjoy our apothecary. So we're real privileged to be able to have some of Dr. Davis's artifacts and furniture. This is Dr. Ben Davis's desk and even some of his letters and whatnots inside this desk. We also have two bookcases full of medical books and legal books. Now behind us outside is our apothecary garden and Dr. Davis would have an apothecary garden and make his own compounds and medicines. Even today we still have some of the plants that he would have grown then that we use today in medicine. Now I said before that George was one of the sons that followed in his dad's footsteps. George was jilted at a young age and unfortunately he never married. He was brokenhearted, so he became a very morose person. He wore black. He was a very talkative person. He liked people, but he was a very quiet man. And George would come in here in the evenings after work and he would bring his friends over. They would have a little organ set up and they would sing and play and debate. He loved to debate so much so that they challenged him to go back to school to get his law degree. They didn't think he would do it. Well, in 1931, back behind you over there is his certificate for law. We were very privileged to be able to get a lot of these items from an apothecary or a drugstore, Bell's Pharmacy, that was here in Beaufort for many, many years. What is the number one ingredient that people used to sell for an end-all, be-all, cure-all kind of uh, medicine? It's alcohol. A lot of these bottles and jars are alcohol. We have Dr. DeWitt's Eclectic Remedy here, and it's 65% alcohol and 25 millimeters of ether. So you're not feeling any pain. One of the items that I'd like you to see is over here in the corner, and these came from Bell's Pharmacy. It is prescriptions, and they're in that cylindrical shape because over the years, they just kind of wore down to that shape. It's just absolutely fabulous to have that in our shop. One of my favorite things in this apothecary is right here at the window. And this is called a show globe. The show globe tells you whether there is a sickness in town. So it's either red or green, no other color. Kids love being on this tour. We have a lot of people that are in the medical field that love coming in this apothecary because they can just see things that they recognize. So this is the end of this tour in the apothecary, but I do hope that you come back and visit us many, many more times. 